Man, I missed you guys. I was gone a week in Mexico uh, serving other people, and it was life-changing. Uh, I wasn't really aware of what would happen on a mission trip, but it was unbelievable. The people were so loving. Uh, we did some construction work. We, we, we did an outreach for children. Uh, it was pretty awesome. So I will never be the same. Thank you for, uh, for letting me go for a week without videos, but I am back now and we are going to get back into Lazy Man recipes. That's right, we're doing a Lazy Man salmon dinner. It should be super easy. That's all that matters. But first I want to talk about, no, not a sponsor, but somebody uh, sent me a pan. That's right, a hand forged by a blacksmith iron skillet. Okay, so I've already broke the string because I took a peek, but it's uh, Christ-centered ironworks. And let me just take off the top here. There's a, there's a disc. I don't know what's on here yet. I haven't even looked. I didn't really want to get into this too far because I wanted you guys to see it first with me. So let's show you what this looks like. Oh man, it's heavy. A little dusty. Love the packaging. Look at this. How cool is that? Uh, it's, uh, each pan is uniquely handcrafted piece of functional art forged by a blacksmith. These durable pans are made from carbon steel, uh, a two rivet construction. All forged pans are very versatile, just like cast iron pans. You can use this on the stove, over campfires, in the oven. You have nothing to worry about. Whoops. Sorry. All right, here it is. Got some low sodium soy sauce. Snap peas, sugar snap peas. Got the salmon, orange juice, two oranges, sesame uh, oil, and boil in a bag rice. You can do minute rice, boil in a bag, just cook your own rice, however you want. I'm going, I'm trying to do the easiest method possible, and I've never done boil in a bag, so I'm trying this today. All right, first thing you're gonna do is hit this with a little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. Now watch how easy this is. We're gonna cook the fish in here. We're gonna boil the rice for 10 to 12 minutes in this pot and microwave the snap peas for five minutes. This is a steam bag. If you don't have a steam bag, microwave in a bowl that's covered with a plate for five minutes. My four strips in. What should I do? I'll probably do three strips to start off. Put my rice in. Water's boiling. Make sure it's completely submerged. There we go. Okay, after three minutes, flip the salmon. Look how beautiful that looks. Wow. Finish it off with a lid. In case there's any part that isn't fully cooked yet, I want this to have a nice flake and it's got an outer crust. So, three minutes, three minutes. Finish off the lid for another minute. And I'm going to place my fish over here on a plate. Let's see if I can't get them all together. All three of them, there we go. Use the same lid on a plate to keep them warm, okay? We have all this goodness. We're gonna deglaze the pan. We're gonna do a little orange juice. A little soy sauce. A little sesame oil. Get your little, get all the goodness off the pan. Deglaze the pan. I'm gonna put a little butter in the dish. Let's get our rice put in. There we go. Give it a good, quick little mix with the butter. Get it all fluffed up. Get that on the plate. Everything's nice and hot. All right, let's cut this real quick and show you how flaky it is. Look at that, look at the flakiness, it's beautiful. Isn't that nice? All right, give it a little dip here, right in the, uh, that orange glaze sauce. Wow, here we go. Mm. So clean tasting, so simple. Some of the rice, <laughs> perfectly cooked, 
Excuse me. And a snap pea. Bam. That is so good. Everything's perfect. Everything came together. It's good to be back. It's good to be doing Lazy Man Recipes again. I'll see you on the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.